Hey guys, I'm back. I'm sorry um, about earlier. I just had to um, get it all ready and set up. So it's all ready. It's all set up. Um, yeah, so let's hop right into it, shall we? Hold on. enough lighting for you guys. Is this good enough light for you guys? Okay. So the first piece, the uh, first couple pieces you want to grab. So the first pieces you want to grab. Um, so we're gonna start off with the feet. We're gonna start with the feet. So for the feet, you're gonna need. We're gonna do the left foot first. They're the exact the same. You're gonna need two one by two reds. Two two by three flat uh, reds. Three, no three. Two by twos, flat, studded blues. And one. And one. One by two studded flat, blue. That's all you need to begin. Oh no, you also need this. You need a light gray hook. These are not that easy to find, actually. You get them in sets, but uh, whatever. Sometimes, uh, you can, if you get enough ingenuity, I can make a video on straight legs where you don't need those. But anyway, that was, that's another video for another day. Let's go back to this. So the first two, three pieces you need are these three. So you're building the back of the foot. So you flip the two by three bread stud over. You grab the uh, you grab the one by two stud. You place it right there. You can see that. Then you take the blue and you fill in the opposite direction. Now you need these two pieces and this. Flip the uh, flip the pe a piece you just made over. Put in the hinge. The light gray hinge, and take a, a the other on uh, one of the blue square uh, flat square, and put it right in the em empty space. Now, for the rest, you need all of the rest. So, for the, so, this is the front of the shoe. So the front of the shoe, the front of the shoe, you take you take your flat two by three studded. 
and place the red, like the last one, right there. As you can see. And then you take your blue, take and you place it right on top over here. As you can see. And you do take them and fill in this area right here. The studs are supposed to be stick the this part, the top part that's going upwards for the f uh, bottom of the palm of the foot is supposed to be sticking that way, not inwards, outwards. And there you go, you got your foot. Now let's read. Now we have to copy it again. Then you copy that over again, and there you go, we got the feet. Now, you can place those off the side. And now, it's time for the upper part of the, and now, it's time for the upper part of the legs. You need two, uh, two, um, two two by threes, red flat, or whatever color you want, I don't care. This could be any random color, but I just picked two reds. The pieces that you're gonna need are four of those. Look, for the first leg, it's four, two of those. One of the green parts. These ones are easy to find. There's some in the Hulk set, Hulk Buster set, um, Lego Ninjago Kai Max set, and all those. You can get those. Two. Hold on. Two. Two of the red one by uh, one by twos, the one by twos, and a gray, a gray hinge ball connector. So the first thing you gotta do is you take this and you take that and that. Move all the rest off the side. First thing, this you put for this one. You put like the foot. You do this for the front. And then you put the ball studded on top. Now, for the rest of the foot, you take the other uh, other one, uh, other one, put that on top of there, and then put the red in the little nook. And then you connect them like that. And boom, you got your foot. Now you're gonna have to copy this again, like the last one. Hold on, let me just build it very quickly. Sorry, I don't have any editing. And then you grab your feet and you stick them on like that. Wait till you hear this click sound. And then that you, and then give it a little wiggle and make sure nothing's broken. And there you go. You got your feet. Move those off the side. Now we're going to do the body. The body, you need two four by six long flats two dark gray ball hinge connector ball connectors three of these gray ball tipped connectors not the flat ones the bit of uh, big uh, big tall ones a tall two by four a two by four a 2x4 regular and four of these four one by two flat and one by four one by two bl uh, black flats well for me black flats sorry so sorry this is just a reminder yeah it's hot in here Hold on. just a reminder this doesn't, you don't have to build this exactly like mine, you can build it however you want, but, um, yeah, so back to what I was saying. First, you build the back side. To build the back side, you need two of these, and one of these. First, you take this, and you put it, uh, take the 2x4 uh, regular, and put it right in the middle 
of the four four by six flat. Then you take these two big gray connectors, regular gray connectors, and you put them at the bottom. So if you put them this way, it'd be on the left side. Well, my left. Yeah, our, no, left side of the block. Left side. Then, what you want to do is you want to. The next pieces you're going to need are the rest. So, for the rest, you're going to want to put this together. Basically, take the two by the one by two gray ball uh, connector and put two one by uh, one by two flat uh, one by twos flats on each end. And hook it in like that. You want to do the same thing but mirrored on the other side. Uh, no, on the other side. And then you need to take the last gray, last gray. Sorry, I bugged out for that for a minute. And take this flat and pop it on top. And give it a good push in, and you got the body. Now, to connect the body, you just line up the two balls and connect and hear that pop. Now, you got the legs and the body. Next, we're gonna have to do the arms. The arms are very difficult, like, like actually very. So you're gonna need two of these. The rest of the uh, four gray hinge connectors. Two dark gray ball hinge connectors. Four two by three flats for them. No. Yeah, gr uh, tan. And four one by two flats. So, first things first, you want to take a flat, like the shoe, again, do that, with both, then, like the leg, like the top, like the top part of, like the second, the, for the second part of the legs, put the gray, uh, light gray, not dark gray, not dark gray, light gray hinge connectors, right in the spot where the dark gray hinge connector went for the top part of the legs. Next thing you want to do is grab two of the regular 2x4 blocks and place them right in the middle, right like that. You all can see that, right? Then you take these and these, and like the back part of the shoe, place them like that. Then you want to plop them right on top like this. The nook and the cranny have to go in like that. And you got the bottom part of the uh, hands. For now, the top part of the hands, you need two dark gray ball hinge connectors. Sorry if I said that before. No, I, I separated them out. I forgot. I'm sorry. Um, you're going to also need eight two by three blacks. Eight two by three blocks. Two one by two a black flats, and that's it. The first thing you want to do is take two of these, the two of the uh, two by three flat black flats, one one by two a black uh, flat a dark gray ball hinge connector and a light gray ball hinge connector uh, no and a light and a light gray you know, gray ditch connector no ditch hinge connector and put them to get and uh, do this so the dark gray goes in this direction straight down on the bottom the light we're doing the uh, right we're doing the right arm the right top arm so, right now so then you take the ball and you put it on this side this side, not that side, this side. Then you take your one by two black flat or whatever color it is and place it right into the empty slot and take the final and take the last piece 
the two by three, another two by three, and place it right on top. Then, and do that exactly the same with the other side, but just fl flip the gray part onto the other side. Now, you take the rest of your blacks, pick up your right arm, and place another flat on top of the top one, and then place another one on the bottom. And do that exactly the same with the other one. Now, grab the two bottom part of the palms and connect them to the ball hinge connectors on the arms. Just grab your body and connect the arms to their sockets on the side near the head. And you got the body. And then you got the body. The head is going to be a lot of tan. It's going to be a lot of the same color piece. If you are trying to build this, it's going to be a lot of tan, the exact same colors. So the rest of the colors I pulled over here, and that this one piece, are all go to the head. So we're going to have two 6x6 six six flats, two 1x6 uh, uh, flats, a 1x6 uh, regular, a 2x6 regular, two 2x2 two two bl uh, regulars, two 1x2 two regulars, four 1x2 one uh, flats, and two 4x2 two two, uh, two flats, like the same for the body, base of the body. So the first ones you want to grab are the, no, the 6x6 six six flat, as you can see here, um, grab the the 4x3 flat, the 4x6 flat, and place it right on top, place it right there, like so, and just click it in. Then, take a 1x6 and place it right here, and just place it in, and smash it in. Then, you take two one by, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. One by six, no, one by two, one by two flats. You place them and leave a li and you place one right there and the other one right there. Only leave this little ditch in the middle open. Leave that open. For the next part, you're gonna need this. You're gonna need this. Sorry, it's running outside today. Uh, this, you're gonna need a, a hinge connector, a big one, a big um, ditch hinge connector. Your two by six long, uh, a two by six regular, one by six regular, two two by two uh, regulars, and the two two by no, and the two one by two regulars. First thing you so the first thing you want to grab here. Let me move these all out of the way. Move that, move that kind of the way. There we go. So the first things you want to grab. So the first things you want to do are take the head, your head, your base head, and put this right here, right where the line of the one by six flat and the and the four by six flat meet. Just right there. Then. You want to grab your the t you want to grab your two 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 by two t uh, regulars and place them right down here near the end the the, uh, the last two and the end of the block uh, end of the hinge connector a uh, big hinge connector. Then you want to take your two one by two t uh, regulars and place them right above those right here. Then, last, you want to uh, finally you want to take this, the uh, one by six tall, place it right there, and then take your, then take your two by six tall and place it right over on top of the one by six tall, and there you go, you got the inside of the head. Next part you want to grab is exactly the same as the last one. You want to grab these three items, no four items. 
So do exactly like the back side of the head, where this part goes right on to over the two by six, the one by six, the two, no, the two, uh, one by twos, uh, and and two dot and two dots of your big hinge connector, like so. So you want to leave this much leaving, uh, this much standing. If I can bring up the light, this much. Sorry, this is gonna be a long video. It's just I have to make this video. I just had to make the video about the gun. So no, my gun, toy, Lego pit thing, whatever you call it. Then you take your one by six flat, and you put it right underneath that, where only this is left. Only this much is left. And then you take your uh, last two pieces. And you pull them right in the empty spots, right up here, these two spots. And remember, again, to leave this spot open. Then you take your final piece, the top part, you place it right on top, smash it down, give it some press, and then you grab your body, and you connect the head. And there you go. You got your own little minifig. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more you uh, videos. Um, put, turn uh, no, post notifications on. Uh, comment if you want if you want to see more. And uh, yeah, I will see you in the next video when I make the gas mask. Bye.